Well, I am at fabulous South Fork Ranch, which this is the event center here. Now, South Fork is famous for, of course, the television show Dallas. And we're in Dallas, which is where I live. Now, one of the stars of the show Dallas was Larry Hagman, J.R. Ewing, you know, who shot J.R. And J.R. used to drive a car around South Fork that was very fitting. Now, not like a Boss Hog car, like a Cadillac with horns on it, but something fitting of a Ewing. And let me show you what he used to drive. He used to drive this white Rolls Royce Silver Shadow. Now, you know how I love Rolls Royce. And this car was up for auction. And believe it or not, I bought this damn thing. What did I do? What did I, what did I do, Dave? Oh my God. So you, ra you raised your hand. <laughs> yeah, I, I was just picking my nose. You were, you were sneezing, reach for a handkerchief. And next thing you know, a Rolls Royce. <laughs> I know, I've, I've never actually even been in this car or sat in it. This is the first time I've ever really looked at it. It was rolling across the block. I didn't think to film myself buying it. I'm, not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reserve what I paid for it. I'll reveal that later. Stay tuned. But um, yeah, there's so, all these signs in here of how Larry Hagman and but this car has so much history. It's been in magazines. They didn't used to do the suicide doors or the coach doors, I don't know. but they made sure that everybody got a cigarette lighter. So, oh, and it's got the little footrests down there. Isn't that sweet? And check out, the, they got the, the little lunch table there. Wow. I might let my old lady drive this. I might let my wife buy it, drive it around. So, great, thanks. EJ, yeah. EJ, says, uh, EJ says you're gonna be the sheik from Cannonball Run. <laughs> Jamie Farr. <laughs> <laughs> EJ's pretty smart. I bought this thing. Yeah, I saw that earlier. <laughs> I wonder how this opens. There we go. Look at that. Oh, wow. Let's see what's in my car. That is a big trunk. How many dead hookers do you think you can fit in the back of this truck? <laughs> trunk here? Well, certainly one weekend's worth. <laughs> <laughs> That's just a Friday night. <laughs> have to do some work to it it needs some leather restoration it's got a few little uh little crackety cracks yeah, it's got some yeah. on the paint yeah. but going down the highway no one can see that no. there's the spirit of ecstasy wow wow so uh, i now own two rolls royces yeah. and uh i Bob hear two rolls royces mostly. yeah <laughs> that's right and i hear I hear that another one is coming up for bid, a very rare red car. They only made like 17 of them. Yeah. Let's go check it out. Let's yeah. go bid on it. What do you think? Yeah. Uh, There's a really unique Rolls Royce going up for bid. Check this thing out. Uh, and he uh, knows a lot about this thing. This Rolls was made, and he can correct me if I'm wrong, um, made for the US. It was shipped over here. This Camaro uh, was used actually by Rolls Royce in, a, uh, in, an, in, the, in an auto show. And then that they the liked it so much, they that. kept it. Just okay, so and um, and uh, they used it for about a year. So we're going to let him tell you a little bit about it. And time period, um, there were 16 made in 1982. Rolls Royce primarily used these for uh, cars to be the center of attention at the auto shows. This has a body by Penafarina. Uh, 27,000 original miles, um, pretty incredible car. They were typically bought by uh, kings, potentates, you know, people that ended up in jail after they finished working. Um, <laughs> what do you think? Not, not I love it. Y'all are It's my color. Um, okay. I'm just going to. So, again, that is a 1982 Rolls Royce, ladies and gentlemen. 
It is the Supercar of Kings, Laidon Dictators, and Rock Stars. It's one of the only 146 built for the U.S. market, ladies and gentlemen. So here it is, ladies and gentlemen, up for auction today. It is a nice one, ladies and gentlemen. Again, it's the King of Cars, ladies and gentlemen. It's retail red. It's got the right color. And ladies and gentlemen, he brought it to sell. And let's sell that for him. It is the Rolls Royce. And thank you, Tim, for bringing that in. I'm going to pay, 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 i am going to pay 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 i am going to
the, I think that's headlight. Maybe you turn. There oh. we go. That's what I said. I, I kept oh, saying. Oh, turn the key. I kept saying, turn the key more. You, I kept saying that. I'm like, are you sure you can't turn that key more? Oh, I kept I'm saying. No what like, that does. Oh I don't know how to turn the light. I'm assuming on. it's a headlight. Here, turn, try, try flipping that. Yeah. See, the headlights are on now. Turn that top switch. Yeah, see, they're off. That's your headlights. Okay. That's what I was telling you. The, the, that's what I was saying, Bob. The, the amps keeps going down. When you, when you flip that top switch, this okay. amp was going down. That was turning the headlights on. Wow. And so I, I'm assuming this, that, that lights up everything. See, that lights up all yeah, your, yeah, yeah. That lights up all your stuff. That's a I test. Think, I think that's the trip. Uh, and then there's these switches. I have no idea what that does. No, no idea, buddy. Yeah. I don't know what that button would do. Yeah. Yeah. Got a good horn. Okay. Horn blows. <laughs> I'll try the, uh... I don't know what that does or yeah. what it's supposed to do or what it used to do. I don't do. know. Somebody, somebody done sealed up your umbrella holder. <laughs> they didn't do umbrellas. On That's what I'm saying. They sealed up, sealed up the umbrella holder on this. Right, oh, here's the seat controls. There we go. Yay. But they don't seem to be controlling it. Oh, wait, it zips up. Power window works. Well, it did. Oh, uh, yeah, this is not working. It's not like a phantom. You know what? I want to... I'd like to take a look at the... Uh... See under the bonnet? I don't... <laughs> I think you can figure out how to get under the bonnet. <laughs> wait, what is that? I really, That's really need to go. Note. Yeah, you're gonna yeah. have to get on and to have him show me how yeah, this stuff I works. So. I know the I know the people watching this who have Rolls Royces are going. This 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 guy is a wanker. <laughs> this, <laughs> this Yankee. <laughs> what, watching this moron geezer. He's a wanker. <laughs> he doesn't know anything. <laughs> look, look at this no guy. business. No business. Look at this guy is a moron. <laughs> the back. This is not the. Uh, the insemination station <laughs> back here. <laughs> driver. Yeah, people with Rolls Royce don't do that. Uh, driver. Hello. M me, me windows not working. Oh, I wonder if that's. I wonder if this is the kitty lock for that. Right now. No. I don't know if there's a manual for this thing. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> now you did it. That's interesting. Little the little mirrors. Oh, yeah. Because they still keep that tradition up. Wow. The leather has seen better days. A few better days, yeah. Yeah. And it's going to need, it's, it's rather hard cracking. Yep. Headliner is great. It's like an OD green yep. kind of a. Yeah. The headliner is fine. Yep. This, this wood could be easily refinished. We could pull this off. Hit it with some high grit sandpaper and re-gloss it, and we probably will do that. The book marking, or book matching, I guess is what I'm trying to say. The book matching they've done on this like walnut here is mm -hmm. amazing. How they they take the veneers and they add these inlays. I mean, it is impressive work. Uh, is you that know. walnut or is that bird's eye maple? Well, I have bird's eye maple. This may be. I don't know. I have to look. I have the documents. I don't. I don't know. So, no. I'm not a wood expert. I'm not either. I'm straight. Yeah, <laughs> you are. <laughs> uh, but, but yeah, you can't exit as gracefully as you can from the modern Phantom. <laughs> it, it's, it reminds me a lot of an older. Save were thinner back. <laughs> McDonald's wasn't as popular back then. Oh, 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 the Holy Grail right there. Yeah, that's. That's what we needed, sir. That's what I needed. All right, that's gonna be a huge the original help. book. Yeah. And a few other things in here. There's a... That's, it's cool because they still use these exact same vents today. Oh, really? There's key. All right, that's what, that's what I'm looking for there right there. Bonnet release catch number seven. Yep. Oh, uh, somewhere right here. Dude, we would never have found that. <laughs> <laughs> that is just crazy. <laughs> we'd never have found that's way under here, right up by the brake, <laughs> right there. 
And look at that. I have no Good idea job, what Bob. I'm looking at. Look <laughs> at this thing. The giant. I don't recognize this at all. Hand. My goodness. My goodness. I Got don't air recognize this at all. I mean, made in England. <laughs> I've never owned one of these. I don't know what I'm looking at. I don't know if that's supposed to be that like that. I uh, probably seriously doubt it. Not, it doesn't look watertight. No, it looks a lot better. Wow. Is this supposed to make uh, <laughs> This says engine. Yeah. Oh, that's oil. Yeah, up here it's the oil. I never pull this out when they're running. But... It actually quieted it down when I pulled it, it out. Did. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> Throw that in the back seat. <laughs> <laughs> Old filter element to be changed every 6,000 miles. Wow. How many kilometers does that mean? <laughs> I guess that's the AC compressor. Yeah, wow, look is. at that thing. Yeah, old cannon. Big cannon. The pillows under here, too. Yeah. London Derby and Crew. Wow. All right. Oh, and there's a little light. Oh, look at that. Yeah, and it doesn't work. Nope. All right. Bob, super cool. Absolutely super one. cool. And then uh, wiper. Yeah, and these wipers are looking wow. pretty bad, too. Yeah. So, and it says upper and lower, so that's probably temperature, I guess. Kind of vents or something. Temperature controls, and then, and then, um, I don't know what this does. Um, I was trying to figure out what these are. Yeah, well, you have to read your book. I said, dear boy, we should go for a ride. <laughs> oh, roomy. Oh, some seats are soft. Wow. Feels feels great. Feel, I feels like I'm sitting on a pillow. This is nice. Don't fart in my new car. Look at that. There's a hazard. Hazards, yeah. And pull off. Yeah, oh, push on. Yeah. We'll be needing those later. <laughs> <for the window>. <laughs> <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> I will say it uh, It drives nice. I mean, the power steering is fantastic. Yeah, you can drive with one finger. We're, yes, actually. Drive with your pinky. We pinky are, finger. We, so we're rolling. We are rolling in the roller. It's not the same experience, I will say, as the Phantom. I mean, it's mm -hmm. a completely you prefer the different thing. You, pre <laughs> you prefer the 30-year newer car made by BMW? 30, this is 67. <laughs> you prefer the 40. So 40. how old are you? I'm 52. So. Yeah. So. <laughs> well, how old's the Phantom, though? Oh, shit. It's in the Phantom 10 years yeah. old? Well, uh, okay. It, well, I was pressing the brake, and it wasn't. <laughs> wasn't braking? It was. It, 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 it was continuing to proceed. It's about to get expensive. <laughs> yeah, and I'll rear into my own Rolls That's Royce with my other Rolls, Rolls Royce. Royce. First world problems. I rear into. Hello, Prudential. Yes. <laughs> wow, it ends with a clunk. It's it's. You know, back, really, if you think about it, back in '67, this was probably pretty posh. It's 53 years old. You yeah. know what I mean? So. And uh, and it has aged better than you. Absolutely, it's in way better shape. I need a full body off restoration. <laughs> this thing, not so much. This thing could just use a little paint, a little interior work. <laughs> you see the, the size of the two. Okay. Like, look at them. You compare, you know, the, 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 the size, you know, just of. of... You find that, Bob? I already you bought it. Damn. You did. Yeah. That's you the bought, one I drove. He bought here. both of them. <laughs> That's the one I bought. What year is it? That's a 67. That is sweet. That's a 2004. We're going to do some donuts and burnouts. Yeah. In the <laughs> that is not going to do any burnouts or donuts, I can guarantee you. you can spray some WD-40 down. Be able to... <laughs> some soap. The closest <laughs> thing to a donut this thing is going to get is the drive through at Krispy Kreme. Nice. <laughs> nice. I have a picture of this car with me and Larry Hagman when I was a teenager. It's on Polaroid. Are you serious? Yeah. Do you still have that? Yeah, my parents have it. Can you get that to can me? You can, can, can you scan it? Can you give yes. me a copy of it? Yes. Here. You, you <laughs> Thank you, thing. Email that to me, please. Yeah, you, I, please. I would be so grateful if you sent oh, that to Santa me. Oh, Santa Claus, remember me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll you you got to send that to me. Yeah. 
You'll need to get up and I'll send you. I'll please, please, you. absolutely, please. I'll buy you a beer somewhere. Anything, yes, anywhere, yes. <laughs> We're at South Fork. We should go over to the, to, to the mansion. Let me lock up that. Okay. Let's go one up. Oh, uh, maybe. I got a cone there, but I bet we'd be all right. We VIPs. So there's a gate. Yep, right here. We'll, I'll open it up. We're gonna let ourselves in because we're in JR's. <laughs> yeah. We're in JR's Rolls Royce. Yeah, we are. There's a light on the dash already. It's a 1967 car that doesn't even have OBD. And there's a light on the dash. Well, we are here. This is South Fork Ranch from the show Dallas. And here it is, 1967 Rolls Royce Silver Shadow. And Larry Hagman, who played JR, used to drive this car around South Fork, around Dallas area. And we're still looking to find out if he actually drove it on the show, uh, because we think he did, and why wouldn't they? But we have to find the episode. So if you're a Dallas TV show expert and you have any information or photos uh, because I'm, I'm meeting so many people uh, who are telling me, hey, you know, I met Larry Hagman and I got a picture of myself with him in this car. So these people are sending. So it's, it's got so much history. We're going to have a lot of fun working on this car. We're going to be not restoring it, but we're going to clean it up a little. We're going to make it a little better. And uh, we're going to drive it. The guy that, uh, you know, ran the auction that I got it from, he said he's been driving it around for a few months, you know, and it's a Rolls Royce. And uh, you just can't go wrong with a Rolls Royce. And uh, never dreamed I'd own one, which has two. Um, I didn't plan on buying this car today, but the opportunity presented itself, and you have to seize those opportunities when they happen. And it was a really good deal. Um, but look at this. So we're we're here at South Fork, and uh, let's check out the front of the house. If you watch the show Dallas, this is the famous front, you know, where they would probably get the helicopter shots and the shots from the road there it is south fork they give tours here so if you're a big fan of the show dallas and you're visiting dallas come out to south fork i'll put a link in the description of the video so that you can visit south fork and take a tour but this is the ewing house and that it's it's a real working ranch and they do tours here it's really amazing so you got to come check it out well we made it back safe and sound the car drives wonderfully it's really cool to have this really neat piece of history uh Larry Hagman and, you know, J.R. Dallas. Uh, that's just, uh, you know, the American epitome of wealth. This thing is a beautiful car. Very lucky to own it. And you can rest assured there'll be a lot more videos of this thing coming up as we start going through it, making it all correct, getting things fixed on it. Doesn't need much, just needs a little loving, you know. So, hey, if this is your bag, make sure to subscribe, like, Subscribe, share this video with your other Rolls Royce loving friends, and uh, turn on your notifications if you want to be part of our live videos. If you love all things British like I do, I'm going to be in Manchester, UK, uh, for the Back to the Future musical premiere uh, this February 20th, and uh, I'll be posting on my Facebook page on Video Bob Mosley and on Boss Prop Shop on our Facebook and Instagram and Twitter where I'm going to be if you want to come out and meet me in person. So. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm Video Bob. Bang! <laughs> Mr. Kennedy! Who shot?